For us to activate the zoom disclaimer, first we're going to open the browser and then let's go to let's type zoom.us. Press enter and then here just click my account. For me, I already log in with my zoom account. Okay, then next go to account management, then account settings. Okay, here. You can scroll down and look for disclaimer or press Ctrl F and then you type disclaimer to make it faster. Okay, see disclaimer. So, okay, now here at first it is disabled, but just click it here to make it enabled. Okay, and then click manage disclaimer. Okay, you can choose either internal participants or external participants, but as for me, I'm just going to choose external participants means all the attendees that will join my zoom meeting they will see this zoom disclaimer and then every time the frequency you can choose but everyone but for me i will choose every time and then now in languages i'm going to choose english it's up to you but here i'm going to choose english then click next here, actually, I already have the disclaimer, so you can put any title you want. And here, the body, so here you can write anything you want. Okay, as for me, I'm just going to have the five rules on my Zoom. Okay, after you finish it, just click the preview button for you to see the outcome of your disclaimer. So, this is it. This is the outcome of my disclaimer. Okay. So now, if you're satisfied with your disclaimer, click back. And then, click save. Okay, so your settings have been updated. Okay, now, we're going to check our disclaimer. Okay, we're going to join a meeting. Okay, this is it. This is now our zoom disclaimer so all your attendees will see this disclaimer before they join your zoom meeting okay they can choose agree or cancel okay let's choose agree okay we're now joining the zoom meeting okay there it is so if you learn something please don't forget to like and subscribe thank you very much